this posture of block to the right. So you breathe in as you change your weight. Pick up your left foot, roll it, step straight down the middle, open your toes, place your heel. That's an in-breath. You haven't moved your arms. You only move your arms when with the body weight behind it. So to do this would be incorrect. That's incorrect. I've lost it already. I might as well not do that movement. So from here, you roll your left foot up, step forward, open it, place it exactly where it is, turn it toes in slightly, and as you roll your weight forward, your left hand is going to just come up in front as you breathe out, and your right hand is going to go back down almost to your right hip as you breathe out. You'll notice that the left hip now is right in my center, about upper chest height, and the right is down on my right hip. This is called pung, or to ward off slantingly upwards. Chin pulled in. Now, have a look at what the hands do. The hands, the left fingers, cut through the right uh, dragon mouth, like this. And then they come to the front. Tai Chi is an illusion. It looks, you might look as if my, ha my hands are going like this, this or something. But really, the hands almost always stay always in the center. Or they simply do up and down motions. Now, all my hands are going to do from this posture is simply this. My hands are simply going to come up and down. That's all they're going to do. That's all they're doing. But it's the body turning. See, obviously, I'm turning my body when I step. When I step to the front, to the north, my body, hips and shoulders are turning to the front. So it looks as if my arms are doing this. They're not opening at all. They're staying in those relative positions and the left hand is coming up and the wrist is staying in the center. Elbow down on, on your out breath. From, we still haven't finished grasping swallow's tail. This is called pung. Now here you're going to do the exact opposite movement than we did when we did this movement here just a minute, just, just a minute ago.